Yo, this is Deontay the Bronze Bummer Wilder, heavyweight champion of the world, and you're watching Real Fans Real Talk. Face facts, what up, what up? RealFansRealTalk.com Where Arthur Diamonds, Trip Young, and Intern Tom For the white and black fans, Asia to Manhattan I get all my facts from my bro Mark the Stats Man If you're not tuned in, I recommend the CAT scan uh -huh, uh -huh. And if your brain checks out, then you deserve a backhand <laughs> Sports, gossip, all the hot topics hey, hey. RealFansRealTalk.com got it uh -huh. They got the hottest bloggers Did Jeremy Lin hurt? We'll log on to the site and you can hear it from them first I'm talking about the latest, yeah, I'm talking about the greatest yeah, yeah. Go check out the art even tell a neighbor, tell a Bobby sent ya From spring to winter, tune in should be the only thing on your agenda Certified coach, son, you know what I'm about, son Real fans, real talk dot com, I'm out, bro Real fans, real talk Real fans, real talk Real fans, real talk dot com Real fans, real talk dot com Real fans, real talk Real fans, real talk RealFansRealTalk.com RealFansRealTalk.com Hello everyone, welcome to another live episode of Real Fans Real Talk. And of course, if we are all snazzied up, suited up, that can only mean one thing. It is time for yet another annual Rifty Awards. Of course, ESPN has the ESPYs. Uh, we, we do a little bit better of a job here on the Rifties, a little bit more entertaining. And of course, plus we like, get the right winners. Exactly, exactly. So uh, before we get into the awards, let me introduce my co-host, the one and only Trip Young. What's going on, Trip? What's going on? You know, it's been a good week. My main man, OJ, is home, so I'm happy about that. Well, not yet. Not till well, October. Not, oh, yeah. But, I'm but they made the announcement, so, you know, next year we we'll probably do the Lifetime Achievement the Award for OJ. Wow. The juice is definitely loose. You're already announcing <laughs> so, that for next year? So we might have to do, have to do it. We might have wow. to do it for OJ, man. Okay. You know, as long as he get his memorabilia and everything back, I think we'll be good. But uh, like I said, we got the Rifties. It's going to be crazy. We got a whole bunch of talent in the building. You know we had to give y'all some performances for the Rifties. So uh, it, it's great. But before we get into all that, Legend in Two Games, Eric Sanchez, what's going on? Just happy to be here, man. I wasn't able to make it last year, so I'm very excited about tonight. Mm -hmm. you know, got a lot of great performance. And, of course, Ladybug is in the starting lineup today. You don't have to wait till the end of the show for the rumor mill. Ladybug on set uh, right well, from the jump. Well, you know, I told, they, they sent me the memo. They said, Ladybug, come on, you got to dress up. And I was like, do I have to? <laughs> like, they sent the email, and I'm always getting on them that they don't prepare me to dress up. So that I was like, I can't, you know, argue now. So, so you look I had to start. You're gonna make you look me good. dress up, then I at least gotta sit yeah. here at eight o'clock. You look good. No. You look good. Thank you, though. <laughs> All right. Uh, before we get into our first award, we have a musical performance from the one and only OnStar. OnStar, take it away. Let that music. Let that music flow. Grab your mic. That's not on star. Sorry, guys. <laughs> All right, technical difficulties. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 Little things will talk. This is crazy. Morning. Might want to switch the camera there. Right? Right. 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 Put the baseball back. 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 Let's try to get away. 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 Try with a straight cold cash, I think I'm on up, pull up, I think I'm on up, watch me like a pocket, no attention to step in, huh, 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 all I got, playing for her, right a clue, spinning a couple of beans on her, so let these hands occur, all of you get to the crew, you pay attention to the little cool, no one into your throat, take it to a higher level. Let me put the bass while you with the trouble. Yes, and I know she's so good. Threw it right up on me and told me to go get it. Caught it with a blow. Baseball. Four, three, two, one. Put the baseball back. 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 Let's go. Try to try to get away. Try to try to get away. Try to get away. Try to try to get away. Try to try to get away. Try to try to get away. Okay, I don't wanna know where the fuck out. You went to the after party, you know fuck out. You can call it 
the sun down. Dudes is at the bar getting their pockets dug out. Yes, do the real deal. Something about the way that you make me feel. Home plate, I was trying to seal. But it's a you guy, and you can not help feel. Together we win and take it over the town. After the summer, finish this on the down. Race is over, but you don't get around. Well, we do like a bound. Yes. So pretty, you were better for me and told me to go get it. Twenty with a glove, baseball. Four, three, two, one. Do the baseball, do the baseball, do the baseball. That's how you open up the show. All right. Shout out to, to On Star. First of all, I, I think you could compete with Chris Brown on the dance moves. Oh, yeah, set it so up. We, uh, <laughs> I was going to say you was about to set it up for next year. We're going to have to get a bigger stage for you on, next man. year because I know you wanted to really go in up there dancing, but you definitely did your thing. And y'all, first of all, y'all should know On Star. If y'all ever had a you know a Big Mac in your life, On Star is the most famous person <laughs> in the world right now. And in the McDonald's commercial, he did his thing on that. And um, he got a lot of good music. And he was on the BET Awards. And he was on the BET I Awards with, I know with, with, with Nick Cannon <laughs> up there. You know? And he actually made the show before he even got here because every Bowling for Peace on Star is out, you know, supporting our youth, working with, uh, with H2O. And uh, so he's been on the show. Y'all seen him dancing on the show plenty of times before. So we definitely appreciate you coming on and opening up the show. We needed to turn it up a little bit, get a little lively up in here. And you definitely did that. So we appreciate you. Just just tell the people at home really quick what you got coming up next. Oh, uh, man. Um, we got two unreleased films that are um, surrounded by hip-hop. One of them is a fictional tale called Wheels. It's about a DJ from Brooklyn. Um, just learning how to be in a new world with old morals and principles. You know, fear, love, triumph, trials. And then you got Roxanne Shantae. She has a biopic. And I play... Um, MC Shan, legendary MC Shan. Mm -hmm. So that's nice. all going down in Queensbridge. That's a good look. What else? I'm going on tour with Rough Riders and um, some more projects with Nick Cannon. We got a record that's coming. It's a lot of good stuff happening right now. That's why we had to get him now before so he starts going on tour. Congratulations. And doing all our other stuff, man. But we again, we appreciate you coming on. Really quick, for y'all that don't know, give them the Instagram, Twitter, all that. Yes, Instagram, Twitter, Google, all of that. A R N S T A R. One more time. A R N as in Nancy. S T A R. On Star. You already know seven letters, one word. You know what you heard. Much love and respect. We're going to get it, especially if it's for a check. Let's go. And somebody <laughs> get my man some water, please. He need a glass of water or something. Please shout out to, to your, your partner over there, too. He did his thing as Yo, well. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. Johnny Dior. Appreciate Fashion you coming Easter. through as well. And since, you know, you, you blessed us with the baseball bat. We usually don't switch around the order of the awards, but we're going to go to the next up award first. So, Statman, you want to tell them who's in the in the category? All right. We got uh, Aaron Judge with the baseball bat. Uh, <laughs> That's right. Pun intended. <laughs> uh, home run derby champion uh, on top in uh, all the statistical categories. Going through a little bit of a slump after the All-Star break, but he is definitely a future talent in the league. Uh, Cody Bellinger. Malcolm Brogdon, Dak Prescott, and Ezekiel Elliott, both of uh, both for the play for the cowgirls, the cowgirls, correct. Yeah. And uh, the, the winner of, of course, you know, you have some Yankee bias over here, but uh, aside from that, Aaron Judge is definitely killing it. So Aaron Judge is the winner of the Next Up Award. Um, Shout out to, to Aaron Judge, Yankees, Bronx Bombers, with the baseball bat. 
<laughs> Definitely. We're, we're running through these uh, awards because we got a few other performances that we want to get to. And, of course, we got a presentation of the Lifetime Achievement Award, which we'll let you know who that is uh, later on. Uh, uh, but the next award is Baller of the Year. We have uh, Tom Brady, of course, uh, with a historic Super Bowl comeback. Russell Westbrook with mm -hmm. uh, also making history, breaking Oscar Robinson's uh, Robertson's triple double record, and being only the second person in history to average a triple double for the season. That is a phenomenal uh, season that he had. Kevin Durant, NBA Finals MVP, getting his first ever championship, leading the Warriors against the Cavs. Uh, the Cavs who lost with LeBron James just wanted to point that out Kevin Durant helped make that happen and then uh Triple G Gennady Golovkin uh who you know I, that man that's like if I left real fans real talk to go to first take of course they're gonna win all the awards <laughs> you know that's kind of like cheating but it's all good all right, well, understandable. Uh, you just Kanye the the. I did. I did. Sometimes you, you gotta do it. Sometimes you gotta just steal the moment right. when it's your time. I'm just saying. And then Matt Ryan, Matty Ice, of course, making it to the Super Bowl and having a phenomenal season, uh, only to fall short to Tom Brady, who, uh, you know, <laughs> in the just, last uh, 12, yeah. 12 minutes. I mean, <laughs> as old as Tom MVP, Brady is, MVP, still, so. still killing it. So yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, Matt, Matty Ice did get the NFL MVP, did not get the Super Bowl trophy. Uh, and the winner, of course, Tom Brady. Uh, I didn't vote for him. I voted for Russell Westbrook. <laughs> Tom Brady. That's my main man, I Tom Too Cool. I think I voted cool. for Tom on that. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I took Tom on Listen, that. I mean, he, he, he broke the, the record for passing yards, passing attempts, and completions in the, Super, in the Bowl, Super Bowl. And he did lead his team back from being down 24 points in the third quarter. So 25. 25. I can't be mad at him getting getting ball of the year. He's been ball of the year for a couple of years now. So uh, shout out to Tom Brady. I know you hate it because it's the Patriots, but you know. I mean, it's not even that. I mean, Russell Westbrook the triple double for a season. I mean, that's that's phenomenal. I'm, I'm breaking Oscar Robertson's record too. I mean, that's just you know a lot more impressive in my opinion. But but yeah. that's been done before. Yeah. Twenty eight three in the Super Bowl. Twenty eight three has never been that's done. Never before. been done. Never been done before. But you know, shout out to shout out to Westbrook. You well, know, he one, he was nominated game, a couple of like, times tonight. So I'm just saying, you know, we talk you, you about records, know. right? Yeah. Russell Westbrook triple double in the season has been done before. Down but, 28 three in the second half of Super Bowl has never been done before. That's that's a fact. You know, and it's regular season. You know, you got to bring that chip home. Okay, we so. can't distinguish the, the amount of triple See, look, y'all distinguish the ball because you broke the record. We do it differently here. See, look, you know, we let see? the people know who we yeah. voting for. See, it is what it is, man. So y'all know, y'all want y'all want to hit us up on Instagram. Or, or Twitter at Real Fan Talk. If y'all disagree with the, the award winners, y'all let us know because that's how we do. Or y'all can send in a fan mail question, fan mail at realfansrealtalk.com. If y'all don't like who we picked this year, I mean, we did it fair. Everybody voted between us and the crew. We all voted. And it just so happened to come out that Tom Brady got it. I'm not mad. Like I said, that's my main man, Tom Too Cool. You know, the GOAT. That's why he's on Madden, on, on the, the GOAT edition of Madden uh, this summer. So you got to love it, man. But who we got, uh, who we got next? Well, you are, we gonna, are we going to go uh, the next musical guest? Are we are we are we ready to go? I well, let me let me introduce V Cassie, the lovely V Cassie. Um, she is a part of Seven Dirty Thirty Dips. That's the you know that's a, that's part of the, the dip sets. I know we all waiting for the dip set reunion, but we're gonna have to start with V Cassie right here, and she's been putting in a lot of work. So we're gonna we're gonna have her just just you can just walk up, just walk up behind, just come on the stage, come on, come on now. <coughs> It's this the Rifty Awards. We just we do what we want to do. We make our own set of rules. <laughs> All right. Now I'm gonna ask Cliff. Can we we gonna we gonna we gonna we gonna get this one, get this one ready. All right. We gonna make sure it's the right one this time too. We don't. All right. Go get that Cliff. Then. Listen, you know we. It's, it's Cliff early. It's the right. Rifty. See, start with Cliff. Early, 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 early in the show, but man. I didn't say nothing about the Eagles yet. <laughs> hey, okay. I knew it was coming. See, I, didn't I, say I knew it was gonna happen. All right. Now, see, I'm just I'm trying to be chill tonight and not say nothing about. The Eagles never won in the Super Bowl. I didn't want to bring that up, all right? But y'all making me take it there, and it's the Rifties. Everybody got their suits on. I didn't want to, you know, do that. But uh, we're going we, we gonna, to we gonna, we gonna wait for a second. We're going to go to to this next award first. V. Cassie, just chill out for one second. We're going to take the next award. You're making you wait because you're talking about the Eagles, see? That's see, listening. don't mess with the man behind the mic. All right, the next <laughs> award while we're uh, waiting for the cliff to 
figure things out <laughs> over there. Chase off, there. Championship <laughs> swag. New England Patriots is the first nominee. You know what, Statman? I'm, I know you wanted to get that award out, but when, when Cliff says it's time to go, it's time to go. <laughs> all right, well, we got the thumbs see? up. We're good to go. <laughs> Cliff said it's time to go, all right? So we got we to gotta, we gotta give him that one. So, Cliff, whenever when you ready, let's do it. Oh, we want you. Oh, no. What we're going to do first is actually go to that award, and we're going to bring V. Cassie back in one second. This happens when, you you are, when you're on live television at you're the Rifties. messing with Cliff, and these are the messing things that we do. We, you know, so, Statman, go ahead. You know, get that award out the way. Let's do that real quick. All right. Once again, first nominee for championship swag is the New England Patriots. Next nominee is the Clemson Tigers. The Golden State Warriors, the Chicago Cubs, and the South North Carolina Tar Heels. Not the South Carolina Tar Heels, just yeah. to make that clear. Right? I mean, there was a crease on the page, and I saw Carolina. <laughs> <laughs> okay. we're gonna, yeah, we're going to have to get the teleprompters slip. for you next uh, time. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I know North Carolina is the Tar Heels. Come on, that's where Jordan I'm, played. I'm just saying, you, you know. All right, I can't, I you can't slip Burgundy. in the tar. You had a Ron Burgundy Ron moment Burgundy. right there. I'm just I'm saying. <laughs> You had a Ron Burgundy moment. I am Ron Burgundy. <laughs> you know? <laughs> but uh, who, who, who's the winner on that one? All right, without further ado, the winner of the championship swag is the Golden State Warriors beating the Cleveland Cavaliers. Let <laughs> me see, we got some Golden State fans over here. That's what's up. That's what's up. Oh, yeah. I didn't vote that way either. I voted for the Chicago Cubs because it's like. You're going to have to get, like, yeah, get security in here. Get some of these Golden State Warriors fans. You got to scream. That man is the Debbie Downer tonight. He's not voting for any of the winners. I mean, I just want to. Boy, yeah, yeah, I, I just want to point out that I disagree with the decision. I mean, the Golden State Seven. Warriors with, I mean, Kevin Durant going over there after, you know, come on. Who did you select? Who did you select? Who did you select? Do it. The Chicago Cubs they didn't win in over 100 years. It's, Fair it's enough. huge. And they, and they, and they, they did come back as, much as, style as, as well, though. Actually, All I'm saying shout out I guess because it's baseball. That boy, Golden I'm State. Like, no problem. <laughs> I mean, no listen, if it makes you feel better, Statman, I didn't vote for Golden State either. If that I'm makes sure you did it. makes you feel better. You know, I didn't. That doesn't I, who's, make it who's, better. Who's, who's he voted for the, for the Cavs again. Exactly. So, so they're, 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 they're not even the champion. Exactly. 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 He did, he did what he was supposed to do, though. Box. He did what he was supposed to do. He yeah, did. Right. He did. We need to wrap it up, box. <laughs> he, did, he did what he was supposed to do. So, you know, I'm I'm not mad at him for that, you know. but uh, And he got the award for his team. He, he helped him out. He did get the finals MVP. So, you know, he didn't get ball of the year. So, that's, you know, that's the main thing. It seemed a little, it's a little I'm just, salt I'm just there. saying. I'm just, you know. I'm just saying. That's how I feel about the situation. You just did a little bit of that. Yeah, right? That's how I feel about the situation. That's how I feel about the situation. So, you know, it, listen, it's, it's, it's all, all right. good. This Shout is, out uh, to Golden this, State. This That's all I'm going to say. Everybody up. See? Yeah. See? Uh, there you go. There we start oh, wait, the wave. We start the wave. You got a next yeah, show there, though. Why are you talking about Golden State with a next show? You're supposed to be repping Brooklyn right now, man. Come on, bro. See, you can't do that. I mean, do you do the same Leave thing. You're yeah, Brooklyn Nets on that point. He does that. He come on the show all the time with a Nets hat on talking about LeBron. Don't worry about that. When the Cavs win, I put my Cavs hat on, though. I was on here with the Nets hat. Look, look. She shouts to the Nets. Shout out to to Isaiah Whitehead, too. Coney Island, Brooklyn, man. You know, we 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 got to do that. We we need we need that that love for Brooklyn right now. So it, it's all good. But again, the Golden State Warriors got that. So I guess you know whatever. I'm gonna talk to the to judges next year and make sure things like this don't happen. <laughs> what, are you just gonna fix it again like you did? Oh, <laughs> well, listen, oh. hey, it is what the it show is. Not even over yet. It's not, this, is, this is listen. <laughs> this is for another show. This is another show. Can we give a shout out to Ammo though? Ammo, oh, yeah, yeah, we gotta give a shout out to Ammo. Gotta Ammo's give a shout out to Ammo. She just look, you look yeah, nice though. She does. She does. She got she, she got, got, she got dressed into. She got like dressed it. up for the awards and everything, and, and you look so beautiful tonight. You got your earrings in and whatnot. What? It's very nice. That's how that's how that's how they you know that's how they treat you sometimes, Ammo. It's all good. There look, you go. There you look, go. see, get, get, let Ammo hey, get some camera see, time, look, please. Hey. And make sure y'all go <laughs> y'all follow on Instagram. She know how to make a drink. She no, tried to get us drunk on the set a couple of times, and we had to tell her to chill. You know, you can't do that because the fans at home are watching. Well, you know, I said, I said, keep coming. We got said, kids that's coming. watching the show. She's a mixologist. Let them know about your alcohol tendencies, okay? Like that, man. 
Come on, don't tell the world, baby. This, uh -huh. I didn't uh -huh. ammo. Keep them coming, baby. <laughs> so just don't, listen, don't listen to what they got this, going this on. Is, this is definitely <laughs> the Rifties. Oh, this is unlike any other award show that you have ever seen or been a part of. It's all unscripted. We go how we want to go. We move how we want to move. You know, and that's just that's just how we do. But it's nice that we all get to come up and get dressed up one time of the year. And we get to pick, you know, who we feel like is the actual winners. Because, you know, sometimes they don't get it right, you know, with the at the ESPYs and, and whatnot. Or, you know, with the with the voting system. So that's why we had to do our own thing. And we had to do the do the rifties to get the real winners. And um, we got a lot that's going they, on right they did, now. did uh, do a good job picking the hosts because Peyton Manning uh, definitely killed it. He did, yeah, he, did. Job. he did. He did. He did. I, I, I hope he didn't hurt Kevin Durant's feeling too bad. I know they say it was supposed to be staged. But I know he felt a little kind of way. He must have felt Kevin, something. Kevin the look on Kevin tight. Durant's face after that show. Yeah, exactly. He, he basically said that, um, for those of you that missed it, he, he mentioned the gym, women's gymnastics team and, and how dominant they were and then followed it up by saying they they did so well that Kevin Durant said he's going to play with them next year. So Kevin Durant's face was priceless after that moment, and uh, but his mom laughed. So yeah, you know that yeah. that that made everything okay. His mom was laughing at the joke. You know, Russell Westbrook had a good time, even though he was trying to cover his face and hide his laughter. But you know, <laughs> it, it happens at the SPs. We don't we don't do that. You know, at the Rifties, we don't just roast the the, the athletes. Well, sometimes we do. I mean, he took but a shot at the side. Yeah, my whole friend about to be like what me. Did. I see you he did. take jabs at H two O head like. We, we get at the athletes too. What we you, do. Oh yeah, but now I'm talking about the rifties. We try to keep it, you know. Oh, at the yeah. No, I'm saying listen. Awards. If, if you go, if you get into the to the to the game and you play bad, we talk about you on the set. All right, but enough of that talking. I want to hear some more music. I f I'm feeling melodic right now. I want to be smooth and you know. So I need a little little, little R and B sounding. And V Cassie is is ready to go. They got us going in in, in the booth. But shout out to the whole to the whole crew. Cliff, David, you came back up. You wanted to make sure everything worked out smoothly. We appreciate you coming up, you know. And uh, you just let you let us know when you're ready in there, Cliff. And we just gonna rock and roll. We we ready? I I see the thumbs up. When soon we hear the music, we we just gonna go with it. Let's go. <laughs> Stage girl, stop playing. Right. <laughs> We're going back onto the bar now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Dang. That, that, that was amazing. 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 You know, shout out to V Cassie. And Thank um, you. listen, she's she's moving. She got a show coming up soon. Can we can we talk about July it? 29th. All right. <laughs> and um, who, I mean, just talk, can you tell them about the show? You want to talk um, about yes, it? Yes, it's on July 29th. It's at the Marriott in Durham, Marriott Civ oh, Civic Center. I'm not mistaken, Jim Jones, Bianca Bonnie, mm -hmm. Freaky Ziki, my president, 
Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be really nice. It's a fashion show, um, Jay Michaels fashion show. So it's gonna be nice. All right. So if y'all in the area, pull up and then tell the people at home. Give them your Instagram, Twitter, all that. My Instagram <coughs> is V Cassie. That's V C A S I. Twitter V Cassie Music. Uh, YouTube. All the accounts is V Cassie. V C A S I. That's it. That's what I like to, to hear. And again, we appreciate you coming. Thank you for having know your, me. Know it your was schedule. a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Exactly. Shout out to the whole 730 Dips. And uh, I love the song, The Grass Ain't Greener. And Conor McGregor is going to find out that the grass is not greener oh, on the other side <laughs> when he tries to make that transition from the MMA over to boxing and uh, fight my main man, Floyd Mayweather. Y'all know I'm down with the money team. So, you know, I just want to send that message to Connor. Listen to the song. It's not green <laughs> on the other side, brother. It's going to be bad for you. All right? No, August 26th. Yeah. Well, it's greener in the sense that he's getting paid more. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, in, that, in that sense it is. You know, but as far as he, you know, he's going he gonna to get his butt handed to him. So, you know. Definitely. That press conference, the tour was crazy. The stat man and I got to go to the Barclays and see it. It was a crazy event. I know people seen it streaming live, but that building, just the energy was crazy. I thought me and Statman was going to get in a fight because he was like, money team. And we got all the, oh. <laughs> as, as else is besides me McGregor was Conor McGregor And out I'm there. just like, all right. You got to watch Statman because he's a little bit I, of a rebel when he's out right like that. You got to watch him. You're going to have to fight your way up out Statman of there. Will no, get you because they had, yo, I, if you follow me on social media, Instagram, Snapchat, I was live. Uh, we was live on the Real Fans Real Talk page. But you need to see the Conor McGregor fans. It was ridiculous. But, um, all those shots was real. Uh, Mayweather really threw that money. <laughs> like, I went on Snapchat like, oh, he really did that. Oh, my gosh. But uh, August 26th, we're going to see because I know I'm going to take that time out and figure that out. Everybody that's going to Vegas, make sure y'all follow me on Snapchat so, you know, I can see. I can live vicariously through you guys on social media. But You either get um, your $100 or... No, I'm just saying, you know, somebody somebody going to have to have a fight going, party and down. invite Ladybug because I'll be in there. I make sure people pay and get in your fight party. I got that. But it's going to be crazy. And if you see me over... This whole year, you seen my whole Mayweather versus the world when this was just an idea. We was just on the couch, just throwing caution to the wind. It's like, ah, yeah. oh, this may happen. Now that they solidified it, it's August 26th in Vegas. This is like, this is going to be like, it's right near Labor Day too. So it's definitely going to be crazy next month. You know what? We might, I, th- I was thinking we was going to do it. I think we might you, just we, have to do we it. We might, might have, have to, to do out. a real fan. And do it, they, you know, you because they maybe they called go. me Look. and asked well, if we was gonna do it. I'm, I'm, yeah, exactly. Exactly. I'm thinking about a fight party. Talking about no, going no, to fight party. No, we going to the fight for trip because we, we know you and Serena, y'all got y'all thing, yeah, y'all so building something. Can she can't fly. And you get on that. You get on the PJ. She too big. Listen, she can't fly. First of all, my wife don't go everywhere I go. I ain't on lockdown like that. I can move around if I want to go to the fight. She gonna pay for it, but the audience is like, what are they talking about? Listen, because now you put my personal business out there. For the rest of us, we just gonna have to throw a fight party and get the bread together. Real fans, real talk. gonna have a fight party. You know, he's special. He's doing something different. You see me? Y'all see I be popping up, man. Online three ninety nine. There you go. I don't know if we can encourage that too much on you know on live television, but that's like you know we we make our own rules. Okay, but no, nah, but in any event, we're looking forward to that. We still got a whole lot left going on. We got another performance y'all going to get hit with later. We got Dope Gang in the building. So we definitely going to get to that a little bit later. But we got we got another award. What, what we got next, that man? Well, I wanted to, you mentioned Serena. I wanted to talk about uh, Peyton Manning and how he took a shot at himself also. He <laughs> said uh, Serena Williams uh, winning with uh, while carrying a child, which is even more impressive than... The Broncos defense carrying me to the <laughs> Super Bowl. So. I mean, listen, we, Super Babies. You know, that's, there you that's, go. that's And what also it is. that uh, Conor McGregor press conference from the Barclays Center. We have the full uncensored version yes. on the Real Fans Real Talk.com Facebook page and YouTube. So make sure you check it out. Facebook.com forward slash Real Fans Real Talk. Parental discretion yeah, is advised. Is the commentary yeah. in there? I think, yeah, I, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm a yeah. sailor. I'm sorry, mom. Yeah. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry. You got a little excited. Hi, well, we, yeah, we didn't curse in the video. Okay, good. It's, okay. Just, it's just, you know, Conor McGregor and Mayweather media. curse like every two words. <laughs> yeah. ESPN actually did a count, I think, 436 times curses between That's the crazy. 
four press conferences or whatever it was. So. It's definitely going to be interesting. I, I, I will say that. But uh, shout out to both of those guys. Looking forward to the fight. Shout out to uh, my wifey for lifey, Baby Boo Serena. She wanted to be here tonight, you know, but again, when you're that far into the pregnancy, you can't fly, so she couldn't yeah. be here. But she definitely sends her regards, you know. And, it, and you know, that's how we do, though. You know, Ladybug, you got to stop being jealous. That's why you don't get to come to the family wow. functions. Okay? <laughs> that's why Statman and Eric came to the last barbecue, and you couldn't because... I don't know what's woman y'all have the issues with each other. I just, the woman, I don't know what's going on with y'all two, but she felt some kind of way about dead. it. Yeah, she did. Yeah, I didn't know. She I didn't know, know there was a little something going on. Okay. She felt the way. It's something we you said on do the show. This right now. Something you said on the show. I don't no, know. What it is. What I'm saying is, is that you know Trip's been on thin ice lately. First of all, all his photos. He been he been dropping some some sus photos. I ain't trying to get in the mix. First of all, that's you know when your wife is looking through your Instagram, I ain't gonna be hitting you up like oh. Ladybug too. Nope, I ain't trying to get that. I'm coming listen, to you as a woman. Nope, I don't want none of that. We okay. Listen, we have that no. relationship. We have a trusting relationship. Okay, she knows no. what I do in my Instagram life. She knows. No. She knows the, the way I am. All no, right, and I'm, she's okay with that. No, it's okay. All right, it's just pictures. It's pictures. It's don't okay. Count. It's all right? okay. That's how because they got you tell, no, because then you pictures. go because you go on the show. You tell people Ladybug dance on tables. Now, if I'm in the DM, I they be like, "That's see, that girl dancing on the tables, you, right?" Yeah, see, you know. See, I look, look. I didn't even bring you. That's I how didn't I actually met Lady Bug. I co-signed it, but I didn't bring it up. You co-signed co it. Uh, you co I did. I co-signed it. I ain't going to nah, lie. I co-signed it. Lady this is not the show for that. Make sure you tune and in every Wednesday to the pregame. That's exactly what y'all told me when I met Shout her. out to the pregame. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't want to have that conversation. We'll take it there. You know what? Back to the Rifties. Statman, what we got coming up next? We got the Lifetime Achievement Award, which is why I was mentioning Peyton Manning earlier. Peyton Manning is the recipient of the Lifetime Achievement Award. Obviously, he is, you know, Top five quarterback of all time. The, mm -hmm. Could have been debatably uh, number one, but Tom Brady, the way he's still lighting things up, uh, you know, kind of, you know, shut the door on that debate. Uh, Plus, I used uh, he to, did mention, like you said, that the Broncos defense definitely so carried him. Yeah, but that's his last <laughs> year. <laughs> that's his last year. Brady got carried you through know. his first Super Bowl by his defense. Listen, we, we act gonna, like that ain't happening. Uh, he bring our receipts. I'm going to let you have that one because, oh, last time, right. because last time when we had to pull up the stats on you over Eli, all right, and, and, I, you see, and, we, and you see what happened. We went back and forth on and that. We, we, I don't want to. I did. I, would, I did watch it on DVR. The debate <laughs> that you guys had. The Colts defense wasn't that wasn't that bad either. What with do you Peyton mean? Manning's first year. They've never. They never had a top ten defense when he won. He said it wasn't that bad. He didn't say it was top ten. It was middle of the pack. But listen, I, mean, I, we, I we, believe we, I, we, I had this debate out. on the real thing. Make sure you man on YouTube. Why you gonna instigate this, man? We already had this out, man. Bob Sanders, top ten. Bob I mean, that's, that's only one player. That was one player. But, you know, I'm going to give Who said, who told you that? Cliff? <laughs> and, and the white Kenny, no, stop, stop, stop. I knew it was going to have to stop. I told him to stop. No, that's your two. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's your two. I tried, I tried to lay off of Cliff. See, I was trying to defend you, Cliff. I tried. And I gave you that picture of Odell. And he's going to come out of here and say something like that. And then you're going to say that. You're going to tell it to the floor director. Nah, the gloves is off on Cliff from now on, This is why the Eagles have not won a Super Bowl yet. Because the fans come in and they just throw ridiculous things out like that. You want to throw snowballs at Santa Close. Okay, I don't even Cliff. understand what's going on. Cliff, you know I what? try to defend you. I'm all literally the time. crying right now. Bob Sanders and who? And Dwight Freeney. That's there too. See, look, he don't know nobody else on the defense. Cliff. He don't know nobody else on the defense. Them Cliff, two. do it. not Cliff. say anything Cliff, look else up, about look up the stats. Uh, I can tell you, I can tell okay. you where the whole defense was. Oh, no. They had like two players on the whole defense. <laughs> I'm not Cliff? even gonna say when the Eagles <laughs> win the Super Bowl. The Don't speak about football nah, again until the Eagles make nah. it to the Super Bowl. They're gonna win. They just gotta make it. But you want time out, Cliff? See, Cliff, I've, I've been trying to rock with you. I gave you that that suspect picture of Odell so that you could use against Trip, didn't I? And then you gonna repay me like this? You gotta, you gotta you stop. You gonna do Cliff. me like this, Cliff? You only stop. at the Rifties, guys. It's only you happens stop. I'm at sorry. the Rifties. Listen, <laughs> listen. Right, we so next week we bring that bobblehead back out. Bobblehead, man. Listen, Cliff. Cliff. Oh, he confiscated it. This is what goes on at the Rifties, ladies and you gentlemen. Right, right in the middle, right act, in the man. middle of trying to give Peyton Manning his lifetime <laughs> achievement award. <laughs> we gotta be stopped by the foolery of of an Cliff. Eagles fan. And you know what? And uh, I'm. You know what? Let's just go ahead, Stephen. I can't do this no more. All right. So uh, he hosts Amos, the SBs send last shots week. Over, please, Amos, send the shots. It's about time for those drinks, right? Uh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
So hosting the SPs last week, uh, all the commercials he does, uh, SNL, and, you know, he's definitely uh, well-deserving of the Lifetime Achievement Award. And we have a surprise. We actually have Peyton Manning here to accept the award. So, Peyton, if you could come forward, please, and accept Peyton. your award. <laughs> Peyton is in the but We need you to come up, Peyton. Come have on, a seat. Peyton. Have a seat. <laughs> come on, Peyton. Peyton. Come on, accept your email. Your, your, your award is an Eli Manning jersey. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know. To so be reminded that your younger brother that won two that. Super Bowls before you did. That, and that you don't know, look like Peyton. That don't yeah, look like that's your Mike right there, If you, 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 you do you look a little different, did you get a haircut or something? You put your jersey on so the fans at home. See, and you know what? And Cliff, this is for you as well because I want you to see what a Super Bowl winning jersey looks like right here, Cliff. The Eagles don't have one of those. Oh. They don't have one of those. They, they don't know what it's like to taste greatness. Okay? That right there, yeah, they, they, they won. They won a couple of Super Bowls. So that's that's yeah, Eli Manning. You know, so yeah. how, did, how did you feel? Uh, you have your mic there. Um, how, how did you feel uh, watching your younger it's brother good. win two Super Bowls before you? Like, Oh, he's uh, he's he's doing excellent. I'm a Giants fan, so yeah. Uh, and I knew I knew that you know, about I, you, I, Peyton. I always yeah, knew that. My brother, you know, I, 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 I wanted you know for him. I, you know what? I like this guy. I like Peyton a lot more now <laughs> since you come on the show. And you know what? You're a real good guy, man. Everything I said about you, Peyton, before today, but you know, you're a great guy, man. Yeah. Right now, it's just you know Papa John's. Uh, Oh, okay. well, you got the endorsements, right? Yeah, it's going um, on. Okay, you're managing Papa John's now. Yeah, right? yeah, wow. and yes, that's what it really comes to. <laughs> you know, we put Manning's lower thirds up there. Let them know. <laughs> <laughs> Let them know. But I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm glad that you got because a lot of athletes just, they don't transition well after you know they retire. So the Papa fact John's. that you moved in from being a starting quarterback to being a starting manager at Papa John's is amazing. You know, I I I, I love what, it, man. I what love what you work. What did you think of uh, the ESPYS? I thought it was great. I loved every part of it, especially like I said, the Kevin Durant part. I thought it was amazing. You did. I mean, you know, you and Eli, I think, are great on camera. I love your commercials. You still doing the Direct TV thing? Yeah, uh, you know, try to fit it in, you know, with, with the ESPYS. Okay, because you, you, you guys, did, you guys actually wrapped you know, few, this well few on a Direct TV commercial. I don't know. Are you thinking about doing an album after, you know, <laughs> after Papa John's thing? Or well, we'll see. Yeah, with the endorsements and the commercials. Because I mean, listen, you got time. You don't have to play that that grueling schedule anymore. So. You know, anything's possible. Like you guys had some bars, so I'm not even mad if you guys wanted want to do it. You know, y'all let me know. I, I know some people, some producers I can link you with if you guys want to work on an album. I think a, a brother album. Y'all both got rings, unlike the Eagles, so y'all can probably do some. Things. I appreciate the support. That's what we do here on Real Fans Real Talk. We support the people that's doing, you know, well and, and, and doing the right thing. And you know, that's how that's how it is. You come on Real Fans Real Talk, we gonna support you, man. We appreciate you, Peyton. I know it's Excellent. you know hard with your schedule now. Before we let Peyton, well, go. I mean the schedule cleared up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. retired. So. Before you let Peyton go, because I didn't realize you were managing Papa John's now. Do we get a special here, Real Fans Real Talk, on the carry out order? Do we get to order, add a little code like, on the internet when they want? sell plot code? See, what do you, you want? Know, I know the audience is probably, you know, can go for a sauce or two right now. I just want to make sure. But yeah, whatever, whatever toppings you want on the pizza. I appreciate okay. it. You're a generous man, Peyton. You know what, really Peyton, man? You're all right. First ballot, Hall of Fame, all the way. Thank man. you. Appreciate you Thank you for coming on with me. Thank you. Thank you. You don't actually get to keep that jersey, so. Just let you know. They take it back, but they put your name on it on the back. It says Manning, so it's all good. Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate you. Oh man, this this has been great. We yo man, shout shout out to everybody that's in the building. On Star V Cassie, and uh, once again we got Dope Gang in the building. Don P, he's gonna be lighting up the stage next. He got a whole lot going on right now. He got a couple of projects that he's he's working on. Right now, he just shot a new video he got. He's getting ready to drop soon. So y'all better be on the lookout for that. Again, this is the Rifties. If you guys are just tuning in, make sure you follow on us on the web, realfansrealtalk.com, Twitter, Instagram, at realfantalk, facebook.com forward slash realfansrealtalk. And, of course, subscribe to that YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash for the fans productions. You can get all the interviews, all the blogs between YouTube and the, and the website. You know, we had everybody who's been on the show. You can find it all right there on the YouTube channel or on the website, realfansrealtalk.com. And again, if you want to send us some fan mail questions in, it's fanmail at realfantalk.com. And uh, every week, you know, we get to the fan mail questions. We love our, our fans, our supporters. So just keep sending in those questions, and uh, we're going to keep answering them every week. Y'all get y'all a little bit of shine.
All right, we got a couple more awards to go through, and before our next musical guest, we got uh, the Style and Autumn Award, Russell Westbrook breaking the triple-double record. Uh, that's one of the no the first nominee. Next nominee is the New England Patriots uh, winning the Super Bowl after being behind 25 points. I think it says 24 here, but 25, right? Mm -hmm, 25. All right, and uh, Canelo Alvarez demolishing Julio Cesar Chavez Jr., uh, Serena wins Battle of the Sisters uh, for Australian Open title. And uh, Andre Ward stops Kovalev with a 10-round TKO. Shout out to my wifey again. Anytime she gets nominated, I like to give her a little drop. So shout out to yeah, my wifey. We used to have an unwritten you know. rule that you always vote for your wifey boo. Like, mm -hmm. you know, everyone's supposed to vote for your wifey but, boo. But, you know, I was getting, you know, I was getting complaints about it. You know, people was getting a little jealous and whatnot. It felt, you know, the bias towards Serena. And I said, you know what? We got a bundle of joy on the way. So we don't even have to. It is what it is. We know she's the GOAT, you know, in tennis. You know, so it, it it's okay, baby boo. You know, you enjoy my I'll come rub the belly and all that. Everything is fine. Who's the winner though, Stat Man? Talk to me. The winner without further ado, Russell Westbrook for breaking the triple double record. So he didn't Shout get completely man, screwed. Russell, he, Russell didn't, Westbrook, I he, didn't, he didn't he didn't win the uh the first award bowler of the year, but at least he gets the styling on him award. So. I mean that's he did he did style on him though, you know, breaking the triple double record. You know, and with his uh, pregame attire and his pregame attire, yeah, he was so probably maybe the most fashionable player yeah. in the NBA. You know, and and he did finish with the MVP. So he got he got a fair amount of awards this season. You know, shout out to to Russell Westbrook. He he made a home after you know Durant left him. He still found a way to get the team to the playoffs this year. Now he's got Paul George. They, they might even climb the ladder a little bit higher. Uh, you know, this coming season. You know, so you I mean you got you got to love it, man. I love what Russell Westbrook's doing. He held on. He still got that team to the playoffs. You did say, Stat Man, he, he he would average a triple double before the season started. You were right when you said that. You know, so shout out to Russell Westbrook, styling on him award. You gotta love it. And um, we gonna we gonna we gonna keep rocking. Y'all y'all let us know when when y'all ready to go back there because we we want to get to the music, man. It's about the music at the Rifties. We like to hear the music. We want to rock out. You know. And uh, so y'all let us know when y'all ready. Y'all ready back there? I'm, Cliff said we ready. So you know what? We just going to gonna rock out. Don P, man, come on, man. Let's hit the stage, man. You can't always try. Yeah. Yeah. Team Bang, Dope Gang, what's up? In the building. What up, Trey? <laughs> we here. We out here, man. We in these streets, man. You already know. Shout out to everybody who came through. Real fan, real talk. Thank y'all for having me, man. What's up, Lady Bo? Hi. How you doing? I'm good. Oh, dressed up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Listen. This right here. Something everybody needs to listen to. It's called down, Daily News, you heard? Uh, it's too many followers and not enough teachers. Marcus, Malcolm, and Martin, we lost all our leaders. Insecure little girls rocking Mac to hide their features. Young boys trying to Mac, use a Mac to hide their weakness. Is it real? NFL players hitting women, guess they ain't get enough hitting in their field. Priceless, America's broke, billion dollar bomb prices, serious crisis, headless reporters, no news on ISIS. Problems in the world, Ebola's got me with a mask like Michael and his monkey quarantine and bubbles. If it's not too much trouble, bring back our girl. Remember the time? There's too many reasons why 1,500 people missing with the planes. I don't want to fly. Obama's Dr. King dream, but still I rise. For the soldiers came home and family cried. For those on 9 11 who families cried. Mike Brown still alive, long as you keep your hands high. Cops murdering for nothing still. Eric Garner choked out his life for selling cigarettes. Cancer. Kills. That is probably at an all time high. That is probably why we all stay high. For those that did that time and ain't did that crime. For the families that lost the child and ain't lost their mind. To a child that lost their mind after they lost their mind. The sign.
And I'm I'm glad you came up here here with a message. I'm a, cause I'm a, I gotta address something you know a little bit in, in a second. But uh, Don P, really quick, tell them at home what you got coming up next. Um, I got the Team Bang Dope Gang mixtape coming crazy with Graph. We also got um a pop up um at the A Law for One Twenty Fourth Street and A Avenue. Also with Yandy and Juju Cameron's girl. We also selling our merchandise. We in there. You already know that the family in the building. You heard? But um, I also have exclusive a video just shot by your boy Trip. Oh, who trying to trip me? Oh, shoot. Oh, I'm in there. What's Exclusive, up, you heard? Yeah. Exclusive, you feel me? You know he only shoot shoot. movies, you know what I mean? That's all he do is make movies, so you know what it's looking like, you feel me? But yeah, we got something coming up. We out here working. And tell them real quick, Instagram and all that. Um, Don P, 4B, D-O-N, P, the number four, the letter B, everything. Google me. <laughs> and I definitely got to shout out Don P again because... He's another one who always comes out and supports H2O, Boiling for Peace. Facts. He's at all the events, and you know how we feel about people that's in our community putting on, because these guys, they don't have to take their time to go to these charity events and, and do the work that they do in the community, so we got to shout him out for that. And again, I want to go back you know, to what he was saying in the song, the message. I was disappointed this week, and you know, somebody who, I, who was my favorite quarterback, Michael Vick, you know, he had, he had some things to say about Colin Kaepernick, told him he needed to cut his hair and clean up his image and, and whatnot. So I had to just, I had to call him out on that. You don't got to do nothing, Kaepernick. You ain't wrong. You, you, you know, you stood up for what you believed in and you standing up, you know, for, for, for black people, minorities in, in general. So you keep doing what you're doing. Definitely. Real fans, real talk. We're going to take a knee with you until the end, man. Definitely. All right. And again... This Michael Vick did reference. apologize. To he did apologize movie. after. No yeah. He had no choice. Uh, after, yeah, after that, you know. But uh, but I, I couldn't I couldn't let that go past this week without uh without without speaking on that because I was just extremely disappointed in, in Michael Vick. That was my guy in Madden for for my whole my college years when I was winning the franchise in my college years. That was my guy, you know. So I had to had to let him know. Who picked Michael Vick? He played for the Eagles. I played, you know, I'll use when he was, you know, when he was well, winning. He was that's when Falcons. I had him. Yeah, you know, when he was when he was doing well, you know, with the Eagles, they don't know about winning. So, didn't I tell Cliff don't talk about football no more? I told him that. Tell him get out your ears, please. Please tell him get out of here. Cliff is out of it. Right? Hit you with the you know, McGregor. Nah, I'm, 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 I'm turning the mic off. I'm turning the mic off. Mic off if that's the case, all right? Because I can still speak loud, Cliff. You know the Eagles ain't nothing, man. You know they suck. Don't even, Cliff. Don't trip, bro. Don't trip. All right. They're not the only team that doesn't have any kind of championship. All right. We can't hear you. Good, good. You know what? The people in the room hear me and they love me. All right. As long as the people in the room love me, that's all that matters. Stanley, what we got, man? Oh, we got one award left for the evening, and that is the Game Changer Award. Draymond Green is nominated for winning Defensive Player of the Year. Aaron Judge breaking DiMaggio's record for home runs by a Yankee rookie and doing it with half the season, basically. Mm -hmm. um, Tom Brady breaks the record for passing yards, completions, and attempts in the Super Bowl. I mean, attempts really isn't, you know, that great of a record. <laughs> but hey, the other ones are broken. impressive. It's a record. It's a record. <clears throat> Ezekiel Elliott becomes only the fifth rookie in NFL history to lead the league in rushing yards. And uh, Deshaun Watson throws for 405 yards and four touchdowns with 73 rushing yards to upset Alabama with a come-from-behind win in the NCAA championship game. Drum roll. Can we get a drum roll for this one? It's the last award for the night, guys. Get the drum roll going. All right, and the got? winner is Tom Brady for breaking the record for passing yards, completions, and attempts in the Super Bowl, and also... Leading his team for Tom too cool. That man sounds so does it happy. again. I know. I I mean, like you lost a little recap. steam there, though, Stadman. You was real hyped <laughs> up when you was announcing <laughs> the nominees. <laughs> and yeah, I, I voted for Sean Watson. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, all right. Tom but again. I want you to keep that same nah, enthusiasm Tom from again. beginning to end. Like, is real, right there. Right there. <laughs> Tom Brady. Shout out to Tom too cool. He does it again. Bowler of the year. And uh, this is the second award for the night. You know, I think the only other person to win multiple awards at the Rifties is my man King James. 
You know, that's the only other person. We know so why. shout out to uh, to Tom Brady <laughs> for that. <laughs> All right, listen. All right, I don't, don't want to hear. That's out of line. That's soon after like, the show from behind the scenes, they're gonna let y'all know what happened. Cause I wonder if there was a tie on. and he just decided to make a tie break. <laughs> the one he follow wanted. me on Instagram. Nah, listen, I'm they, I mean, the this issue, they like the Tom Brady out there. What can I say, man? The, the, the I, I want to see the votes. It's on the man to see the votes. Listen, this ain't gonna be Watergate, okay? All right, don't worry about the paperwork. Don't worry about that. It's done. The awards have been given out. Riftgate. Don't worry about all that. Everything. Everything is. Cope Aesthetic, we good. Shout out to my man Tom Brady again. And I definitely want to shout out everybody who performed today. Everybody did their thing. Yes. I'm looking forward sure. to hearing new music from each and every one of you guys. You know, it's, it's, it's dope when, you know, when people come out to support you. You know, you support them and, and, you know, and vice versa. And you guys are all amazing. So definitely love all of y'all yes, for coming you, through. Thank you. Thank you. It's, it's the Real Fans, Real Talk Awards, man. We got we to gotta just live it up. Can we talk about this coordination, fun. though? Right. I, just, I just like this uh, we, little listen. Blues Brothers going that's right. on Recognize coordination. Who you're dealing with. Like, even with the ties. The ties that's got right. the little dot pattern. Like, y'all right. you, you ain't never seen two big brothers this smooth with this With the big, black shoes. Right? Yeah. Y'all not playing. Recognize who y'all dealing with, man. We this is exactly what I wore when we won the the uh, Be Free Award Don't tell the people that. Don't tell them that. Don't give away your secrets. I'm trying to do the fashion side of it you know because we didn't have time before to say who you wearing and all that so we gotta do it yeah we got some some time left so you know so so you're redoing our be free look <laughs> but that's good luck so it's all right because we won and if y'all see that that looks really nice we did win we did win it this year for brooklyn you know we we, we finally took it you know the bronx been showing us a lot of love they're still showing us love but you know it's always good when you come home yeah. And you get that award from, you know, in your borough. So, you know, shout out to, to, to the Beef Free Did Awards. Did we ever explain that story, though? Know, recognizing. Of how, of what happened and how we had to, like, rush on stage. Did we, can we say, do we have time for that? Since we're we going to lady boy. I like saying stories. I'm a storyteller. <laughs> anyway, so we was proud for the award. But, you know, Trip being the diva that he is, we were late. Oh, so we couldn't my get into goodness. the auditorium. So, gonna... so we had to stand in the waiting <laughs> bar area. And that wasn't a problem for us. So we standing. They did the nomination. So we're like, okay, let's listen. We're going to toast just because. So they're like, real fans, real talk. But we're outside of the, of the whole thing. So we literally had to run through the door. But it was fun. But I didn't drop my drink. I put my drink down. Yeah, I put my drink down. No, I brought he, my drink. He brought his drink uh, uh, on to the stage. I keep telling y'all, recognize who y'all dealing with. With his little with. umbrella Trip. and and That's right. That's Trip how I is a real professional. And exactly. That's how real professionals you know, do. You don't have, you don't was, have time sometimes to put your drink down. Was, I, gave, it, I gave my nah. speech and I didn't drop a drip of my drink at all. I finished nah, it, and then we kept drinking for the rest of the night. Then we to the <laughs> we after party. It, but it was kind. Of, it got crazy, you know. But <laughs> sometimes it get like that, you know. With real fans, real talk. We got a lot of friends and a lot of people, you know, that like to party with us, and you know. And so it, it was a it was a fun night. Yeah, we you had, know, and then, you know, we doing the Rifties after party, yep. by the way. And, and, so yeah. make sure you guys stay tuned, Real Fans, Real Talk. Now, they, they, can they see that, though? What? They I'm can, saying we, it's we, an only invite lady only. Bug. Only on social say, media. I'm yeah. saying on social media, you guys follow Real right, right, Fan right, Talk. Right, right. Yeah. DM to get the location. All right, all right. Because you see we dressed up. Like, we just not going to go yeah. home. You know, I mean, listen. But. <laughs> y'all know I can't stay out too late tonight, though, because, you know, with the missus. But, but, uh. <laughs> Anyway, all right, but we do we, before we because we, we got a little bit of time left. We got a special guest that's in the building. We're gonna bring up for for a quick second. You know, we got we got we got to give him a little bit of shine. All right, so Cliff, you you cue us when you want us to bring him up here. You know, we I right, you know what? Come on up. Come on, Man, come on down. Keep trusting Cliff much longer. Come on, Cliff. Yeah. Cliff. <laughs> Oh, Cliff, again, this what is... What a surprise, You're just as unorganized as the Eagles, the oh, general managers. What's going on today? To Thank you, that last joke. I did. Thank I'm you, sorry, Cliff. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just keep telling Cliff, you know, it, it's... Look, hold on. This oh, yeah. You, you got the flies guy in the building. He coming out for a second? First of all, yes. you got the Jesus piece on and all that. Yes, I remember. Man, yo, one minute, hold on, man. Come you want to come? See, get, 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 him on stage. get him on First stage. Get him on stage, though. <coughs> oh, you gonna wait? You gonna perform right now? You gonna give us a little? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Get on stage. Right right now. Now. Hold on. Go ahead. The stage is over there on the left. Okay, we gonna have we gonna just talk to him for a second. 
All right. So First of all, where, where's the, the Wendy Williams shoe cam? When they got the shoe cam on the show today? Mm-hmm. For the rip right these, look at this. Right. You know I what? Love it. Nice. Right there. Okay, listen. Thank you. Get, hey. get the shoes. Oh, my goodness. Y'all got to recognize who y'all. I need his go. autograph before the show is over. My man, you, you a fly young man. You are a fly young man. You know what? <laughs> Introduce know. yourself. The gla- he got the, the he, aviators looking fly come on, right man, there. You're doing it right now. Tell, tell the people at home, you know, tell them about yourself. So my name is Young Trail, and this is my clothing line, as you can see. Um, we're working on it still, but we've made like seven outfits. And if you know, if you were just wondering, my Instagram is Young Trail Music. Okay. And my website is youngchild.com. My man, yo, nice. Prince, how old are you? Seven. <laughs> God nice. bless. Must Keep the swag, though. The swag is on a million right now, though, man. We, de- oh, we might have, yeah, we're going to have to get you to come back and perform because I say we're running out of time. But go ahead, tell us, tell us what, what else you're doing because you got a lot of stuff going on. Um, I'm going to be performing later. Oh. And I'm going to be like, I'm, I'm really appreciating this. No problem. Oh, we appreciate you. Listen, we appreciate you, you coming through. You make that in my size, though, because I like the, the bling bling. You making that in my size? Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, I was on Love and Hip Hop season seven of Love and Hip Hop, okay. New York. Mama, I right, made this movie units. Yeah, I, I like that. Yeah, hey, he doing he doing this thing, man. I mean, it's the flyest little guy in the business. Look, I mean, he got the jewels on, no, they got the Jesus piece, the shades. Um, my first, I got um my song not coming is out, and I'm gonna release two more new singles titled Rockstar and Mr. Softy. Okay. Is he is out here. Don't yo, he moving. He moving. y'all gotta respect it. it. Y'all, y'all see when the young. First of all, y'all know we support our youth. You know, so shout out, shout out to you, man. We appreciate you coming on and showing us what it is to be styled. You know what, yeah. Russell Westbrook, you just lost the style on him award. It's yours now. You got the style on him <laughs> award <laughs> at, the, at the fifth annual. And, and you know what? We gonna we, we before we wrap things up at the Rifties, we definitely gotta got gotta shout Cliff out. You know. His birthday, his birthday is, is, is tomorrow, so we want to shout Cliff with. out. <laughs> and um, where, where's Peyton? Peyton, get the Eli jersey. No. Um, we're gonna give, give it that to, Cliff, to you. That's Cliff, that was that's actually your birthday present. That's why we couldn't give it to Peyton to keep. We just had him wait on the show, but that's actually for you, Cliff, because we love what you do every week. You come here, and uh, but with that being said, though, the fifth annual Rifty Awards for myself, Trip Young. Mark the Stabman, Scavage, Ladybug, Legend in Two Games. Hold on, we got Don P, V Cassie, we, we got All Star, we got Young Young Trail in, in, in the building, and everybody, everybody. That, that came out Ammo. to support us. Yo. Ammo, behind Ammo. the bar, Always the whole crew, the everybody, it's on. We'll see y'all next week. <laughs> and we, well, we'll see y'all next year, suited up at the Rifties. But next week, we're going to be back here live, Real Fans, Real Talk. Check us out on the web, realfansrealtalk.com. Nice. We up out of here. Good night. Good night, everyone. Hey. After party for real, though. Nah, I'm saying. See, here you go. Start trouble again. <laughs> don't get on no tables. Real yeah, bad. Exactly. Yeah, you can't do that. Well, Arthur Dom is tripped young and intern time. For the white and black fans, Asia to Manhattan. I get all my facts from my bro, Mark the Stats, man. If you're not tuned in, I recommend the CAT scan. Uh-huh. And if your brain checks out, then you deserve a backhand. <laughs> Sports, gossip, all the hot topics. Hey, hey. Real fans, real talk.com got it. Uh, they got the hottest bloggers. It's Jeremy Linhart. We'll log on to the site and you can hear it from them first. I'm talking about the latest. Yeah. I'm talking about the greatest. Yeah. Go check out the archives. Even tell a neighbor. Tell them about from spring to winter, tuning in should be the only thing on your agenda. Certified co-sign, you know what I'm about, son. Real fans, real talk.com. I'm out work. Real fans, real talk. Real fans, real talk. Real fans, real talk.com. Real fans, real talk.com. Real fans, real talk. Real fans, real talk. Real fans, real talk.com. Real fans, real talk.com. Bomb.